At least 78 individuals have tragically drowned, and many more are feared missing, after a refugee boat sank off the coast of Greece. This incident marks the deadliest migrant shipwreck off Greece this year. The victims, mostly men from Afghanistan and Pakistan, were aboard a boat that capsized near the southern Peloponnese region. The vessel, believed to have carried several hundred people, departed from eastern Libya with the intention of reaching Italy. It remains unclear whether the boat was a fishing trawler or cargo ship. Rescue efforts have been underway, with approximately 104 passengers having been rescued so far. Greek authorities, along with the EU border agency Frontex, have been involved in search and rescue operations, utilizing Coast Guard vessels, a Navy frigate, military transport planes, an Air Force helicopter, and private crafts. Initial rescue attempts were hindered by strong winds. Speculation regarding the number of individuals on board the ill-fated boat suggests that up to 600 people may have been aboard, although this has not been confirmed. The incident highlights the escalating risks taken by smugglers to evade patrols as they increasingly operate in international waters to reach Italy instead of the heavily guarded Greek coastline. The longer and more dangerous journeys are a consequence of seeking alternate routes, due to heightened security measures. In a separate incident, a rescue operation was underway off the coast of Crete, as a yacht carrying over 80 migrants was towed to a port on the southern part of the island. Greece has faced criticism for alleged forcible expulsions of asylum seekers, violating international law. The country's former center-right government government facing re-election later this month, has denied these allegations, describing its migration policy as tough but fair. The tragic event has led Kyriakos Mitsotakis, Greece's former prime minister, and Alexis Tsipras, the main opposition leader, to suspend their electoral campaigns as a mark of respect. According to UN data, Approximately 72,000 refugees and migrants have arrived in Mediterranean bordering countries Italy, Spain, Greece, Malta and Cyprus this year. Greece has long been a primary route for individuals fleeing conflicts, persecution, and poverty in the Middle East, Asia, and Africa.